name is Andrew Jenkins. I'm 24 years old and I've been in the Xena Garrison program since I was 12 years old. During high school, I also played tennis and I was a varsity tennis player and I was also one of the top tennis players in the state of Texas in the Super Championship Division and I was able to graduate as the valedictorian of my high school class with a 4.0 GPA. The Xena Garrison program has been somewhat of an extended family for me. They've uh, given me an opportunity to grow and learn more about myself and uh, just have good mentors and role models. John Wilkerson has definitely been somewhat of a father figure to me. Even this summer, after having going, gone through some personal struggles, I came back and he, he gave me some good advice and an opportunity to help, help with the kids again this summer. Good job, Brooke. I came through this program uh, starting when I was 11 years old. I was introduced by one of the former coaches. Um, I came here, uh, I can say lost, uh, finding someone to guide me. Uh, tennis was an avenue that I used to um, help me through life. Making the transition from being a student now to a coach and a mentor to these kids is, is awesome. I can say that I've been lucky to give back what I was given. Um, I, I, I remember looking after the coaches as a, as a father figure, as a role model of someone I wanted to be and gave me hope. And now I know that I can, do, I can be the same thing to, the, to these children in the academy. I trained in Houston in a program similar to Zena Garrison Academy. You know, my dreams started on the courts of McGregor Park under the mentor of John Wilkerson. And traveling and having Zena as a teammate. And now that we're both coaches and having coached with her on the Olympic team, it's just been a great experience. I, I think I've impacted many kids' lives, not just on the court, but off the court, and, and giving them guidance and leadership. And maybe tennis isn't always the only thing, that there's many other options through their education. So I stress other areas of tennis. We really uh, stress the educational component here at the Zena Garrison Academy. Every day when the kids arrive here at 4 o'clock, they, they go into the room and do their homework. We have tutors. We have uh, Girls, Inc leadership programs for boys and girls um, to mentor them. Playing here at Lee LeClaire is great, but it's limiting in the, in the fact that we only can play from four to seven. I think it's important for us to have a, our own center where we're not constricted for the hours that we're here. Ready, position, turn, step, hit. Very good, give me one more. I started doing this back in 1972. I had the opportunity to be a player. I won, I qualified for the U.S. Open. But a long time ago, when I was a young kid, I knew what I wanted to do in life. I wanted to help others. I thought I wanted to be a preacher. I thought I wanted to be a teacher. And now kids say I'm the both of them. Lori's addition to this program has meant so much, not only to me, but to the program, to all the kids. Lori's a person that's been there, done that. And Lori has been top 10 in the world. Lori has won major championships. Lori and I are one voice. I see like miracles happen. I see kids one day as negative and not positive and I see the next day I've seen them change tremendously. That's what keeps me going. To give a chance, a kid a chance to get away from all the problems they have away from this tennis center. To give them a chance to find themselves. It's a, it's a happy place. It's a free of fear place. It, Give them a chance to realize their dreams, their aspirations. If they want to be a doctor, a lawyer, or whatever they want to be, tennis will give them a chance to be that. I feel like tennis is almost uh, an analogy of life in itself because while playing a tennis match, you might be down or you might be up, but you still have to have a good mindset and a positive attitude in order to stay the course and finish up. I attribute my success, my college education, all to this program to give me the discipline and the knowledge that it takes to know what it takes to become a productive human being and a, and a good citizen. One thing John taught us was to give back through the program. So that was just giving is just really a natural part of uh, just when you're successful you need to go back and, and give back. So it's important to me and it's a special place in my heart. If I affect one kid, that one kid's life will go out and affect a hundred other kids. Each one of those hundred kids will affect hundreds of other kids. So you are making a difference, and the kids need that, because sometimes the home is not able to provide what the kid needs. We can do that. We are